We are living in a world where social media has completely romanticized the quitting of your 9 to 5 jobs to pursue your dream, start your own business, or even do full-time content creation. Now don't get me wrong, the entrepreneurial life can be so so rewarding and 9 to 5s can be awfully dull and rigid, but in my opinion, quitting with no backup plan is definitely a privilege. In a world that can be very critical, I wanted to just share my perspective on this and why I actually love my 9 to 5 job in data science and why ironically I feel like it gives me so much freedom. Hopefully this video can inspire some of you too. So the first thing that I love is the constant learning and growth that I can get in the role. I love that no two problems are the same and I can continue to develop my technical skill set over time. The tech landscape is constantly evolving and we have to remain very reactive to new programming languages and technologies that are being developed. As an example, I knew nothing about prompt engineering or generative AI, but over the past couple of months, I've done so much work in this space and significantly upskilled in it. Next would be the creativity and inherent satisfaction that I get from solving problems. Very rarely is there a set process that I have to follow. The work itself is challenging and dynamic and I get to be creative and figure out my own solutions. Some days I could be working on a new product feature, other days building a predictive model, or even just help stakeholders identify data anomalies. And when I'm craving a change, I can always work on a different product or even just pivot industries completely. And there is also a huge dopamine hit when your project goes live, you submit your first PR, or that problem you've been stuck on for the past week, you finally debug. Honestly, that sense of satisfaction and achievement is really unparalleled. And I feel like anyone working in tech or coding can relate to this. Another reason I really enjoy this field is the direct impact that I can make on my organization. Data is a huge part of our everyday lives and it is only growing exponentially. Every time you open an app, you make a purchase, you speak on the phone, watch a video on YouTube even, it is being tracked and saved in a database somewhere. And because of the nature of technology, the code that we write can be scaled across various industries, platforms and products to add value and drive decisions all within an instant. Another point that I have to mention is the compensation and the financial stability. Whilst money isn't everything, it is definitely a significant motivating factor in why I chose this career path. The tech space offers some pretty competitive salaries and in addition, the working hours are often very reasonable and very flexible. That said, the role is definitely challenging, especially with how prevalent AI and data have been these recent years and expectations are constantly rising, but I remind myself that each challenge I overcome only makes me a more employable data scientist in the future. And this also results in financial stability because I know exactly how much money is going to come into my bank account every single month and I can plan my life around this. There is no expectation to work after hours, meaning I can go on annual leave and enjoy my weekends and not have to think about work at all. And lastly, the culture is a huge part of this job and why I've stayed in this field for so long. Working in data and tech means that you get to collaborate with a diverse range of people across different teams. And throughout my career, I've worked with some of the brightest product managers, software engineers, UX designers, and marketers. And these people have all given me a fresh set of ideas and perspectives, making myself a better data scientist as well. And there is something so rewarding about everyone coming together, brainstorming and delivering a product from start to finish. Overall, I really enjoy my nine to five and the sense of identity and purpose that it has given me. I'm definitely not making this video to brag. I know it's so easy to focus on all the negatives in our lives. So I'm hoping to just highlight and be a bit more grateful for the opportunities that my nine to five have given me, including the starting of this YouTube channel. So hopefully it can inspire some of you to pursue a similar path. Feel free to check out these two videos up on the screen. And as always, best of luck on your journey. Take care, stay safe, and I will see you in my next one. Bye.